All right, today we are back at the villages and we are gonna try Metro Diner. I looked online and believe it or not, these are a lot of places in all of the states. I think I saw one was even in Delaware. Um, we're back by, let's see, Beef O'Brady's, Bonefish Grill, um, NYPD Pizza, all that same area. So we're gonna try another place. Let's go check it out. Metro Diner, breakfast, lunch, dinner. Let's see if we can get the hours here. 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. every day. And as we go inside, here's what we got to work with. We've got a bar, uh, like a diner bar. And then you can see all the seating area in here. All right, so this is where they seated us. Here's just another view of the diner. You can get Metro to go right there where the locals eat, what it says up there on the wall. And they've got a big board over there that has a bunch of like specials. Trying to read on their back board there and it says sweets, chocolate cake, key lime pie, something pudding. And I can't read what else it is. We'll have to ask what the desserts are. And then this bar right here, a couple TVs up there. They've got cappuccino, latte, espressos. All right, and here is the menu got some dinner favorites, some burgers and sandwiches, starters. On the back, we've got salads and soups, breakfast for dinner. I always like that. Sides and refreshing beverages. They do have cocktails and beer. I think I'm gonna ask and see what flavored teas they have. So sitting here right by the uh, coffee maker and stuff, it smells like coffee, so it smells really good in here. All right, so I asked about their flavored teas and they have raspberry tea and you can get it sweet or unsweet. So I got unsweet raspberry tea. So Timber said sitting in this little booth makes her feel like the, the booth they sit in on the King of Queens. And look at that. I do feel like that too. That's hilarious. Looks very similar. Okay, I asked the waitress and she said it said strawberry red velvet bread pudding. So I said we're definitely gonna have to get that. Okay, there are several things I'm looking at. Now I do like breakfast all the time, but I'm looking at maybe the spicy honey chicken sandwich or the grilled three cheese because it is a rainy day today. And what better to eat than grilled cheese and maybe, do they have soup? So yes, they do have the soups, but their soup of the day was like some kind of it's a corn chowder. Corn chowder shrimp something she said it doesn't sound like it would be good but it's very very good so i don't know if i'll get a grilled cheese i was looking for like maybe tomato soup i really don't know what i'm gonna do right now there's a lot to choose from i'm probably gonna ask which she would do between the grilled cheese and the honey chicken sandwich and let her decide but then it does come with your choice of all this down here below they also have mac and cheese and gluten-free uh bread what did you say you're gonna do a cup of the chicken noodle soup Steamed green beans yep. and something and else. Something else. I don't know yet. Hmm. I'm just gonna let her decide. The waitress decide what what I'm getting today. And here we have the raspberry tea. Now I could be wrong, but I don't think it's just like your typical um, pre-made raspberry tea. I think they have some kind of like raspberry flavoring that they put in there. Um, but yeah, it's good. Again, it was unsweet. In addition to the coffees they have over here, it looks like they also have a full bar. Also, now I can read the soup board over there, and it was roasted shrimp corn chowder soup is what she said, and she said it's really good. I asked her which one I should get between the grilled cheese and the uh, honey chicken sandwich, and without hesitation, she said honey chicken sandwich because their honey hot spicy sauce is delicious. So I got that with fries and ranch. I came closer to their board so we could read what else they have and look at this red velvet griddles Herb chicken Shrimp platter seafood platter and then here are their sweets chocolate cake key lime pie Cobbler red strawberry bread pudding flavored tea and coffee peach and hazelnut shamrock mimosa I have to say everything looks delicious Holy smokes, look at that. That sauce on there looks so good. And then look at the big bowl of the chicken noodle soup. The green beans look delicious. And then you also got some fruit. It all looks very good. 
All right, I cut it in half so that you could see what the middle looks like. Now you've said all of yours is delicious. Mm -hmm. They put some kind of seasoning that's really good on the uh, beans. Green beans, yeah. Cool, I'll have to try that too. All right, here we go, we're gonna try it. Oh yeah, that is excellent, stinking good. Whatever sauce it was, the uh, sweet heat, something like that is it? Hot honey. Hot honey. Hot honey sauce is very delicious. You can see it's steaming right now. Though. Look at that. I'm gonna try it with some ranch. How's everything? It's mm -hmm. great. Awesome. Yes. I told you. It's so good. That good? sauce is so good. <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. glad. It's awesome. Right. Thank you. Thanks. So she likes it too, but here is it with ranch. And their ranch. That is some good ranch. That is, I'm gonna go ahead and try it fry and dip it in the ranch because that is some very good ranch. Yep, good fry, good ranch, good meal. I give this place so far. Big thumbs up, let's see what you say about the ranch. The ranch tastes like homemade ranch, doesn't it? And good fries, all so good. Anyway, I give this place a stinking good, really good stuff. Last thing to try on my end, pickle. Of course, a pickle tastes like a pickle. Try a green bean. Good flavor on the green beans. Of course, I'm not gonna try the fruit because fruit's fruit, but I will try the um, soup. Ah, soup. Look at the steam come off that too. Good, great. That is a good meal to have on a rainy day. So everything seems really good. Can't wait for the dessert. I have to say I have no complaints. The hot honey little sauce stuff, very, very good. It's not too spicy. It doesn't like burn your face off, but I would come back here and get this again, 100%. So here's the other half and you can see the chicken is bigger than the bun even. So it's a, it's a pretty large meal. All right, I'm starting to slow down and I think I'm gonna kind of take it easy since we do have dessert coming because I definitely want to eat more of the dessert. So I'm getting full on fries. There were a lot of fries. You're almost done with all yours. And then we'll have our dessert coming. And here is the dessert. I can smell it right now and it smells very, very good. And it looks very good. Look at those strawberries on top. So we're gonna dig in. Here we go. That is very good. If you like bread pudding, you will like that because that is very, very good. Now let's get the strawberries up top with the little like, sauce. Yeah, that's tasty, that's good. I don't know if you can hear it on here or not, but they just started playing Hall & Oates and we went to a Hall & Oates concert. So I'm gonna put that video in the corner of this video that you can click on and see our experience watching them. Ah, slowing down. I think we're pretty well done. Very good though. All right, it is now raining, so I'm walking to the car, but I'll make it quick. Overall, great place, I loved it. I would get the chicken sandwich again, so good. Um, if you're out in the Villages area and you're looking for an, another place to eat, I would definitely try the Metro Diner. And apparently if you live in other states, it's there too, so go ahead and try it. Um, I don't think I pronounced anything really correctly in there with all the sauces and the desserts that were the, the soups, but hey, it happens. But with that being said, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.